What's going on guys? Sister Sensor here. Uh, just wanted to start out and say thank you guys all, all so much for the support. Like honestly, lately you guys have been totally awesome. I know I've been super sporadic and everything. Life has just been crazy and honestly I really just didn't have much to post. I'm trying to work out a few kinks so this way I could get some stuff out more regularly. But yeah. Anyway. So, um, yeah, you guys all know I recently went away to Disney with my mom, and we had a wonderful time, guys. We had a blast. A um, little funny story, though, and some of you might be really mad at me, but hear me out. And I swear, this happened. So, me and my mom are walking through or whatever. It's almost about time for the fireworks show to start. And I ended up talking our way into like this VIP section. So pretty much the people that are in there are only the people that paid for tour guides and stuff like that. You know, like celebrities and all that sort of stuff and rich people or people that just splurged and bought a, uh, a tour guide for $3,000 for the day. Anyway... So I talked our way into being able to go into there for the fireworks showing, and it was this great spot. It was like kind of like astro, all astroturfed over. It was dead center in front of the castle. We were a little bit of a ways back, but we got to see everything. The view was beautiful. It was unobstructed. It was great. So happy about that. You know, we're there. We're hanging out. We're waiting for the fireworks to start. We brought, you know, we got our dinner to go, and we brought that with us, which was great. And then... All of a sudden, this, you know, picturesque looking family comes in. There's just like one really tall guy with a hat on. He's very plain looking, you know, nothing overly, you know, he didn't have like crazy hair or anything like just very normal looking, dark hair, dark eyes, very tall, very normal looking, right? Gorgeous blonde wife. I mean, she is like beautiful, right? And then there's like these three adorable little kids. They got their big stroller. They're all happy. It is like the cutest thing ever. Well, you know, and he's standing and standing and standing. And suddenly the fireworks show is like just about to start. Like we got maybe two or three minutes left until the fireworks show starts. So I just go, um, excuse me. Hi. Yeah, sir. Yeah. Do you mind sitting down when the fireworks start? You're kind of blocking everybody behind you. I'm sorry. I don't mean to bother you, but... You know, you're kind of, we can't see. He just kind of gives me this weird, like, type of a look. Like, almost afraid, but kind of, like, what the hell? I don't really know. Just gives me, like, this weird look, and I don't think anything of it. I start chit-chatting with his wife. You know, we had a little conversation. I can't remember what we talked about. I, honestly, I really, I can't remember. But it was just, like, a normal little conversation. And, uh, you know, she started to look kind of familiar to me, and I'm like... Where have I seen her before? Definitely seen her before. And I looked over at the husband again. I'm like, you know, come to think of it, he looks really familiar too. I really, I, I just, I can't think of it. What, what is this? Who, why do I know these people? And I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm like, he kind of looks like a younger version of the guy from the Papa John's commercials, doesn't he? Huh. So I asked my mom, I'm like, mom, do you know who that is? And she's like, I, I don't know. I have no idea. So I start Googling, like, who's the guy from the Papa John's commercials? And that's, you know, obviously Peyton Manning. And I'm like, oh, wait a minute. He has a little brother. So I looked it up. I just told Eli Manning to sit down. Needless to say, my stepfather has wants to banish me to the netherworld at this point because he's a huge Giants fan. And I just told, essentially, his superstar to sit down. So yeah, he, he's going to get me back somehow for that. And I didn't even think to get like a picture or an autograph with him because, you know, first off at that moment, I didn't realize who he was until it was too late. And then second off, we had these great views for wishes, which honestly was way more important to me than, you know, going to see some celebrity because that's, that was my last time seeing my favorite thing at Disney World. So pretty much it could have been anybody and I just would have been like, I don't care. <laughs> Plus, I'm not really one of those girl crazy celebrity type of, you know what I mean. I'm not like one of those crazy fangirl type of people. But it hit me and I'm like, oh crap, I just told Eli Manning to sit down. Oops. But yeah, I wasn't about to get kicked up out of my spot for a picture or anything like that. But I thought that was really funny and I figured you guys would like it. Um, yeah, I got a couple of other things coming up. Uh, me and Phil are going back to Disney World in October for the Halloween party. 
you know, hopefully we pay that off in time so this way we actually can go, but right, right now we do have it booked. You know, it's booked. We have a plan. We have to pay it off. And we're going to be going in the very beginning of October, which is going to be great. It's me and him, and who knows, maybe even my brother and Yannette might show up and hang out with us. You never know with us. Because, you know, Yannette's a big Disney fan, too. So that's cool. I got a couple of other things coming up more recently. I'll get into as, you know, they come up more and more. Um, I gotta get some more cooking videos out for you guys. You guys seem really seem to like that. Do you guys have any specific recipes that aren't, like, fish-related? Because I have allergies and such that I don't really, like, you know... I, I don't deal with fish. I don't deal with fish. I don't deal with shellfish. I don't do it. We don't eat it. It would really go to waste, to be honest with you here, so... Yeah, but if there's any non-fish related recipes you'd like me to, you know, cook for you guys, let me know down below in the comments. Um, yeah. On the other hand, uh, let's see here, what else is going on around here? Let's see here, mom's doing good. Papa Sense is doing pretty good. I, I actually gotta call him. I haven't spoken to him in a few days. Yesterday was actually Poppy Sensor's birthday. Not that, you know... Not that any of you guys would have known that, but, you know, he had a good one from what I heard. Um, what else is going on? I know Doug's got something coming up really cool. I think he's going somewhere soon, in about a month or so. Maybe he's going to hang out with some of you guys. I don't really know what the deal is, but shush, shh, you didn't hear it from me. All right? Um, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. That's going to wrap it up for today. If you guys, uh, yeah, like I said, leave a comment down below, like, subscribe, and I will see you all next time.